Get ready to meet Pixverse V3. It's here and it's changing the game in video generation. In this tutorial, we are diving into the fantastic features that make Pixverse a powerhouse. From its text to video magic, to the ability to bring your own images to life with animation. Join us for a look into the future of video creation with Pixverse and prepare to be amazed. Let's kick things off by visiting the Pixverse AI website. The site's been completely redesigned with a sleek, modern look. Nothing like the simple layout of the past. Right on the homepage, you can click around and watch captivating animations and videos generated by this AI. This interactive experience is truly unique and exciting, giving a whole new feel to Pixverse V3. I am genuinely thrilled to see if the video generation is as impressive as the site itself. With that excitement, I click the Try Pixverse button in the top right corner, which brings up the sign-in and registration page. You can log in using Apple, Discord, or Google accounts. I go with Google and log in. The V3 interface is a delight, with the user profile option conveniently located in the top right. Here's a nice bonus. As of this tutorial's release, creating an account and visiting Pixverse for the first time gives you 130 free tokens to use for video generation. Of course, this offer might change, so please don't hold me to it if it does. I value transparency and want to keep you informed. Now, let's check out the token system. By clicking on the token count icon, we are taken to the AI's plan page. We are currently on the free basic plan, which gives you 100 credits as a sign-up gift with no additional top-ups, plus 30 daily recharge credits. This is an exciting start, and I am ready to see what Pixverse 5.3 can do. If 130 credits don't quite cover your needs, you might consider upgrading. The next plan is $8 per month, but I would recommend fully testing the AI with your free credits first. Get a real feel for what Pixverse can do before deciding if it's worth the investment. And just so you know, Pixverse isn't sponsoring this video. I am here to give you an honest look. Back on the homepage, you will find the Discover section where you can check out creations made by other users. Click on any video to view it in full size. And here's a handy feature. You can even see and copy the prompts used to generate those videos, making it super easy to get inspired or recreate similar results. To generate my first video with Pixverse V3, I head to the Create page. At the bottom, there's a prompt text box ready for input. Let's dive in and see what kind of magic we can make with a few creative words. A prompt is just a way to put your ideas into words. Aim to describe your vision clearly, so even someone totally new to it could picture what you mean. Add details like objects, emotions, colors, character movements, facial expressions and setting, plus elements like time of day and camera angles. The more details you give, the better the AI can bring your vision to life. And for a little extra help crafting your perfect prompt, try tools like ChatGPT, Google Gemini, or Claude. I paste the pre-written prompt into the text box and just below it, there are some new and handy options for video generation. The first option is for selecting the video generation model. Right now, we can choose between versions 2.5 and 3. So naturally, I am going with the latest version. Next, we have a set of preset effects like out of frame, zombie mode, monster invades, and a few others that can add a unique twist to your videos. After that, there's an option to select a style for the video. You can choose from anime, 3D animation, or clay. The next option is for setting the video duration, where you can choose between 5 and 8 seconds. At 5 seconds, it uses 30 tokens. For 8 seconds, it uses 60. For this example, I will keep it at 5 seconds. Then, under Quality, we can pick between HD and SD. Moving on, the Aspect Ratio setting lets you select Square, Landscape or Portrait Ratios, which is super useful for social media platforms like Instagram, TikTok, Twitter or YouTube. Since I focus on YouTube, I am going with the 16 to 9 ratio. Next is Motion where you can choose between normal and performance modes. I will stick with normal for now, but will experiment with performance in future tutorials to see the difference. The character panel also looks interesting, but it deserves its own tutorial. Lastly, under additional settings, 
we find the negative prompt feature where you can specify any elements you don't want in your scene. With everything set, I click Create. My request goes into the queue and in moments, the text prompt transforms into a video, which I can watch in a video frame. I am honestly blown away by the quality. Pixverse version 3's text-to-video process is stunning. Another exciting feature available now is the Extend option, right below the video frame. With Extend, you can keep building onto your scene as long as you have enough tokens. Just click Extend, add a new scenario in the text box, and choose the duration, 5 or 8 seconds, to lengthen your video. When you're done, you can simply click Back to exit the Extend mode. Once your video is complete, there's a Download button right below the frame, so you can save the MP4 file directly to your device. Pixverse also offers an Image to Video feature. If you have a photo of yourself, a loved one, family, friends, or anyone else, get it ready. We are going to animate it and bring it to life. In the bottom left corner of the prompt box, there's an image icon. I click on it, select the image I want to animate, and upload it. After uploading, the image's thumbnail appears in the bottom left of the prompt box, and you can view it in full size by clicking on the thumbnail. Want to bring your images to life? It's as easy as writing a prompt to tell the AI what should happen in the scene and which parts to animate. Let's say you have a character in your image. You could ask the AI to make them talk, smile, look excited, or even show emotions like sadness or anger. Or maybe you want them to move. They could walk, work out, or dance energetically. You could also add weather effects. Imagine it raining, the wind blowing, or a storm brewing in the background. The exciting part is that there are no limits. Any idea you can think of can come to life. Your only boundaries are your imagination and the words you choose in your prompt. Once I finish writing the prompt and specifying the animation details, I click Create. My request goes into the queue, and within moments, the image animates exactly as described in the prompt, transforming into a video that I can watch in the video frame. The results are simply stunning. I am genuinely amazed by what Pixverse version 3 can do. The performance of Pixverse version 3 is remarkable. Without this AI, animating an image like this would take days, maybe even weeks. But now, with just a single text prompt and even on the free plan, we have an incredible scene ready to use. It's almost unimaginable how easy this has become. Did this tutorial help you out? If so, show some love with a like and share it with your friends. This is just the beginning. There's so much more to explore. If you are ready to dive into the world of AI, you are in the right place. Hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you never miss a thing. Remember, AI is the future and together we can embrace it. See you in the next tutorial.